Well, I'm joined now by Charles Henry, who's our Shadow Minister for Post Offices. Charles, thanks very much for coming down to Devon today. We really appreciate it. And I know that the party has campaigned extremely hard on this issue of keeping rural post offices in particular open. What a lot of people are asking is, what is our policy with respect to post offices? How do we see helping them in the future so that they'll thrive and prosper? No, that's right, Mel. I mean, we've had a very, very strong campaign to keep post offices open. We forced a debate in Parliament to make Labour MPs decide whether they actually wanted to continue the closure programme or suspend it whilst we looked at the flaws within it. But what we've said is the best future for the post office is to do what the sub-postmasters want. They want to survive on business, not subsidy. So let's find ways of bringing more business into the network. Let's help them work with other carriers. Let them become an outpost for the delivery of government services and council services. Let them look at more financial services, just as the Federation is calling for. And then use the subsidy to keep more of them open. And that's the tragedy of this whole closure programme, where we should have been looking at how we build up the business. The government is looking at just how they can manage the decline. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Charles, for coming. Appreciate it. Thank you.